Make sure you have your blog open as well as the page that you want to insert it to. Go to your blog and scroll to the bottom. And down here it says embed into your page. So click once on that and then you need to copy the code at the bottom. Once you've copied that, you go back to your Google Sites page and click on the edit page icon. You will see that this turns into an editing box and your editing menu appears here. You need to decide where you're going to put your blog. So the easiest way I find is to simply, for example, I want to put it here. I type XXX and that's where my blog will be embedded. And then I go up to HTML, click on it once, and I find the XXX. If you have a very long page with lots of code, you can simply hit Command F or Control F and click XXX and it will take you to the right place. Highlight that and then paste in the code from Globster. Now, this is going to be far too big for our Google Sites page, so we need to change the scale, the height and the width. So we're going to start with 50% scale equals 50, then go to width, and we need to make sure that these values are all related. So if we change it to scale 50%, we need to half this, so half 960, 480, and then again with the height, so half 1300, 650, and then we click update. We can see that the Google gadget has been embedded, although we can't see what it looks like. I always like my blogs to be centered, so I'm going to align center. Then go back up to the top of the page and save so I can see what it looks like. It will take a minute or a few seconds for it to appear. So there we have it.